I just wanted to make a quick video. Uh, this morning before I left for work, me and my husband found this timid little dog. Sorry, my hand slipped. Um, she probably is only less than a year old, or maybe she is a year old. But, um, I don't know if she is or not, but she's so... Look at her. She's bloated and she's not pregnant. The, uh... I don't know who, but somebody around here was feeding her glass and uh, just dumped her. She ran away or they dumped her uh, in her excrements. She had leaves and twigs and glass in her system. Um, she was used as a, she was trying to get, uh, their, they wanted her to be a fighting dog, basically. So they're trying to make her mean, uh, irritable. Um, but, uh, we have taken her in since then. She's right now resting. She's drinking a lot of water over there. Like, don't mind the TV. That's just junk. But, uh, as you can see, like, there's a mess here. She don't know no better. Atrocities of human nature, right? I know. Uh, she's I eaten, like, guys. two bowls today. We're going to give her stop. more tomorrow. Um, she's drinking a lot of water, like, a lot of fluids. Uh, so hers could get better. And guess what we named her? Because we're adopting her now. Her name is Fig. <laughs> Your name is Fig. She's so adorable. She mm -hmm. looks like a fig. She's so cute. Look at that. Yeah. With these kind of dogs, you got to be very careful, what my dad said. Um, you cannot, you know, with a, even a paper, you can't bat them on the nose. You can't, you know, pat them on the butt. She's just so timid, like, and she was trained for fighting, so... We don't want to risk, uh, you know, triggering that traumatic sense of hers. But uh, her got a bone. It's kind of dirty now. The other dogs have kind of demolished it a little bit. And they even got the filling most of it. Almost all of it, yeah. But yeah. Um, this is Fig. She's just a baby puppy. She's a brindle mutt. Uh, mostly pit bull and Labrador. But she's a good girl. She's just tired. Tired of walking and eating all kinds of guck that's not good for her. But we've been feeding her and now she's in rehabilitation. So we'll be making a catch up videos on this. Um, she, gosh, she's just pretty. Look at that beautiful lotus on her head. Just so beautiful. She's gorgeous. That light pattern she is so beautiful she's so special um i don't know who exactly is doing this to all these uh dogs in this particular breed but it seems like they're they have one particular mama or something um possibly related to my dad's dog as well near nearly from the same litter maybe from uh maybe he's like an uncle or something i'm not sure but uh we do know it's somebody around here that the dogs are running away because they're trained for fighting and um, making a, in part of my language, a, a bastard um, rich off of harming others. So again, more updates will be coming soon. Uh, we'll see how uh, well she's doing after about six weeks, maybe a month. But we're going to just feed her, uh, try to get her better, like, more hydrated. And she will become a better puppy, huh? Her become better puppy, yay, oh, oh, sweet time. Oh, I'm sweepy. I'm so sweepy, I'm so tired. Oh, 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 and by the way, this is a new color. <laughs> look at her. Oh, look at that. It's a pit bull, right? Mm-hmm. Yeah, um, word on Lola. She's actually my neighbor's dog, but she's taking a liking to us, so it, it, we're almost like her secondary family, pretty much. This is not Lola, this is Fig. But, uh, Lola was the, um, Figs are my brown favorite. and white one, the spotty one. But, uh, she was the other pit bull, my neighbor's pit bull. She probably here right now. Mm, but, um, yeah, we were just taking care of her for a while because it was the winter and she got off her team. She keeps... She continuously gets off her chain because her, uh, her daddy's a truck driver. So, him not always here. But, him take good care of her. And the neighbors do too. 
But yes, occasional letter in here, but with the uh, fig now moved in and all comfy cozy. Um, they will scrap, especially one being pregnant and the other one being a little bit of a puppy. And also being a fighter, so. We already know who will win. Which is not good. But no, she is a good dog. She's very timid. She's very, uh, well-trained. Um, she's also already figured out where to poop. And that's, um, if we're not here and, uh, she didn't get out on time. Because my dad's kind of broken. Now I gotta work. But, um, yeah, when uh, she didn't go out and potty on time, she knows that I put down some paper for her so she can piddle on there, go poop on there, and whatnot. And she always got fresh water, she always got food. So, yeah, she's well taken care of now. And, uh, she will be on a hopeful, speedy road to recovery. So, more on this later. And,. We will see how how well she starts to build up herself and how much we can make her feel good right now. Right now she's comfy cozy on her Totoro uh, f fluffy thing. Put layers, but it's a pillow, a feather pillow. Put this underneath there just in case the uh, piddle happens. Because uh, yes, it's happened before and I had to wash it. And then there's this, which I double layered her. Four layered, it's a pretty decently sized blanket. Yeah, just so she's comfy. Okay, alright, we'll talk to you later. Bye! See you, bye, V. Bye!